Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine. What about you? Well, a little bit crazy. <laughs> <laughs> it's a crazy day. Yeah, it's still a crazy day. All right. Yes, it's Monday. Yeah. Mondays are usually really crazy. It's true. Okay. Let's see. Do you hear a sound? No. Excuse me? Do you hear the sound? Or it's just me? No, just you. <laughs> okay. It's a scary sound. I know because of Halloween, probably. Yeah. <laughs> That's so weird. Okay, wait a second. Yeah, it was that one. Oh my God. Well, welcome everybody. Hope you are fine. Hope you're well. It's a new week and it's a holiday on this week. So we're just going to have four days. Four out of five. <laughs> and it's not raining anymore, right? Yeah. Hopefully. They say that probably it rains this week. But yeah, at, at the end of the week. Mm -hmm. That's what I, that's what I heard. Okay, so besides the crazy Monday, what else? What's new? Good news. Exciting news. No. No. All same. All same. A lot of work, a lot of things to do. Right. Yeah. Busy days. Not, yeah, yeah, but nothing exciting, nothing All interesting. Right. <laughs> nothing is Until now. Yeah, <laughs> true, true, true. <laughs> well, it's Halloween. Yeah, too. <laughs> Probably some people right now are in a party. Yeah, the ones that have the traditions, cake of wearing costumes, Asking for trick or treats, probably. But I mean, it's American tradition, so you would. I mean, you don't have to. Just some people, or Americans, probably. Okay, great. I saw messages. Yes, good evening, good evening, on the chat. A couple of readings. It's great. And we are here. That's a good thing. Be thankful for. Yes, it's a new beginning. How's the platform? Are you completing the platform? Right. So far? Haven't yet? Yes. Take a look at it. Okay. Make some minutes to advance to work on it, to make progress. That'll be really awesome. Okay, so attendance time, let me see. I'm going to check it out here. We have, today is the 31st. Monday. On a Monday, imagine. October 31st. <laughs> what an interesting date, right? All right, let's see. Adriana. Not here. Oh my God. What happened to Adriana? Let's see. Okay, Carlos. Present teacher. How are you? I'm fine. A little bit tired. All right. Everything went well in Chalatenango and Cabana? <laughs> <laughs> I, Everything okay? Yeah, see. Uh, all work. Uh, all right. Nice. No problems. Uh, the yeah. problem was back. Return. Oh, My return. Back. Uh -huh. Complicated. 
It's complicated. All right. Friday. On Friday, you came back on Friday. Yeah. True, 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 true. Okay, Elsie. Back here. Present, teacher. Hi, welcome. Hi. Okay. Tired. And a little, a little tired. Good. Yes. Drink a tea. Drink some coffee. <laughs> to <Yeah>. relax. <laughs> to unwind. Okay, <laughs> Fatima. Not yet. Perma. Not yet. Maybe on his way home. Okay. See, Hector. Present teacher. How are you? I'm fine. Good. I'm fine. Thank you. A busy day? A uh, busy, busy day, but okay. close to the end of the day. <laughs> <laughs> All right, almost, almost the end. Isabel. Present teacher. I see you from the beginning of the class today. Yes. How was your commute? Great. It was great. Not much traffic today? Mm, not much. Okay, mm, thank God. Only normal. The usual. <laughs> yes. Yes, two hours only. <laughs> yes, yeah, two hours. Okay, I know. Catherine? Present teacher. Hello, how are you? Great. Great. Oh, nice. Nice. Lucy? Present. How are you, Lucy? Very good, thank you. All right, glad to hear that. Mayra? Mayra? Hey, present. Hi. All right, thank you, Mayra. Let's see. Nuri? Nuri, Nuri. Va here. Roberto? Present. Present, hey, teacher. Hey, good evening. How are you? Fine. Great. Fine, teacher. Nice. Nice to hear that. Samuel? Present teacher. Hey. <laughs> Sorry. It's all right. Vitelia. Present teacher. Hi. Welcome. Walter. Walter hasn't joined, hasn't connected yet. Oh, Christy, I didn't mention, right? <laughs> and why didn't you say anything? Oh, yes. True. Wendy. Wendy here? No? Not yet. And Irma? Not yet either. Oh, right. Okay, perfect. Let's see. Today we have to have a lot of conversations, interesting conversations. Let me just share. The presentation for the class of this evening. Okay, so today is Monday, October the 31st of 2022. This is the class number 11. Yeah, two weeks and a, and a day. True. Okay, and definitely we are still talking about manuals, okay? Do you have manuals in your work to know about the objectives, the policies, and the different structures of the rules, okay, that we have to follow in our work? So per practically, this is what we're gonna do. Okay, we're gonna discuss, let me, uh-huh. To start with, for the class, we have a manual, okay? So you must have it as well, <laughs> okay? So let's see. Yes, yes. Yeah, 
we finished on this one. Yes, last class. Okay, how to create an effective manual for a training. And we used this uh, description to use the sequence words, right? Like first, then, after that, and finally. But now we are going to make suggestions about the relevance of a topic in a procedure, procedure manual. Okay, so a manual is a document that we have from the company, right? Where to start, what to do, what to do first, what to do next, in the case of a procedure. So this is practically, okay, yes, what we're going to be studying, what we're going to be doing, and to start with, we are reading that information on a manual with the procedures in your workplace on the manual that we have for the class as well, right? So this is really relevant information because it's what we usually do, okay? So to start with, but since everybody needs to participate, we're going to have, let me see, I need to take a look at this. I'm going to choose one and everybody has to participate in a conversation. Let me just get one. Hold on. One minute, please. Okay, this one. Okay, pick and speak. <laughs> All right. This is one activity to start the class. For example, if I say, okay, pick and speak. So we choose this topic and you speak about this topic. For example, the topic says birthdays. And you will have to speak at least for one minute about birthdays. You will say, yes, I love my birthdays. I love to celebrate birthday. We usually buy a cake to celebrate, whatever. The idea is that you speak. So you have to be ready, okay? Think about ideas. Lo único que no pueden hacer es quedarse callado. Y ahí lo demás, if you don't say correctly, if you make mistakes, if you don't pronounce very well, eso, right now it's not important, okay? The only rule is that you cannot stay quiet. You have to speak. Are you ready? All right. <laughs> yes, we are. Here we go. All right. Okay, 30 seconds, this acá, but I'm going to give you for 45 seconds to one minute. Let's see. Vamos a ver, la primera persona to participate would be uh, Hector. Okay, what is your definition of happiness? My God. Oh, my good. What is your definition of happiness? Mm -hmm. For me, the happiness is, uh, is my health, my family, my spirituality. I don't know who say spiritual. Is, A spiritual uh, life. Spiritual life inside mm -hmm. inside me and make happy to my family, to my friend, with my with my work, with my 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 be. I don't know how to say my. Uh, this is happiness for me. I can I can make happy happy my my friend, my family with my. Um, my work, I don't know, my study, my comprom compromise. Commitment. I don't know. Commitment. Commitment. Is it good? Is it, is it, is it bad? It's, it's, it's a good, no, it's a good, it's a good word. Right. Commitment. Okay. Uh, I don't know. They help my, my gust or my spirit, uh -huh. um, help my body. Help my 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 family. I think teacher. I oh, don't know right. what say because I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> make, 
45 minutes is all a right. lot of time. <laughs> it's all right, no problem. Let's okay. continue with Samway. Okay, describe the scene of a busy market. A busy market, like a supermarket or? Uh -huh. uh... Or the market, like the local market. Okay, I go to Santa Tecla market. Uh -huh. uh, uh, every Sunday, almost. Uh -huh. And it's uh, crazy when it's a payday because we can find, or I can find a parking lot. And then a lot of people buy uh, all the tomatoes, the potatoes, the the cucumbers and I have to do a list to to bring to my house and save 15 days with with the, with the product with the food but I enjoy a lot of uh, going to the market because I can eat and I can find it the kind of uh, food I love and I can uh, uh, cook for example this weekend I do a uh, gallina india uh, Indian chicken. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> nice. Yes, that's what a busy market looks like. A lot of people trying to find a spot, trying to buy their products, right? Okay, let's we'll go with Isabel. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> why do you think why the reason why do you think people smoke uh... <laughs> okay sorry Isabel, but this question is could be for me <laughs> <laughs> but Isabel probably has an opinion too <laughs> why why do you think they do it, it? it's not for you Samuel. <laughs> I I don't smoke. Uh, but why do you think people yes. do it? I don't smoke. And I believe the the people smoke. And I don't I don't love you. Him and themselves. They don't love themselves. Yes. All right. Because I I had. A, I had a uh, uh, many co-workers and you smoke uh -huh. every every That's day a break. <laughs> after <laughs> after the lunch after the lunch you smoke every day and I I think the I think <laughs> <laughs> they do it for fun. They do it just because. I I no no, como decirle no no veo la razón para. I don't understand the reason. Yes, for the to do the smoke. I have to have that activity. Yes. Okay. No problem. Okay, it's just a conversation. Remember, this is just to speak, just to promote the speaking. So everybody has an opinion. Let's see. Who else? Carlos. <laughs> the brave ones. <laughs> ah, what makes a good boss? Uh, what makes a good boss? Mm -hmm. mm, good boss can be a, a boss. Uh, for example, um, he give me a, 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 a I have a fault. <laughs> uh, permission, permission. Uh, uh, I have a day off. Uh, a boss, a good boss is a person, uh, a good direction. Uh, a good uh, order, work for orders. Uh, I think. 
All right. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> somebody who's flexible, somebody who gives you permission, somebody who gives you some bonus. <laughs> That's a good boss. It, I like your it's definition. Also, also <laughs> it's, it's current me. Oh, ah, okay, <laughs> correct you guys, you teaches you. All right, nice. Okay. That's a good boss. Christina, are you ready? <laughs> it's just like anyways. What is a slaughterhouse used for? No idea. Okay, we can get another one. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's okay. The house is, is, is Germany. It's Lauster House. <laughs> We're going to look for this. Uh, this describe a, a scene at a resort. Like the Cameron is a resort. Describe a resort. Um, with my family, with my family in the beach. <laughs> um, what else? What else? Relax, relax. <laughs> Relaxing. Uh -huh. um, Enjoying. Taking yeah. photos. <laughs> eating. <laughs> All right. Nice. Let's see. Who else? Walter, are you ready? Uh, sorry, what we are going to do? We're going to choose a topic and you have to describe or talk about 45 seconds. Okay. Mm -hmm. There we go. What causes a forest fire? What are the causes? Uh, what causes a forest fire is is about the trash, about the pollution, about the uh, different kind of, uh, for example, person that start to fire different things. Um, maybe the the uh, um, how do you say? The hot weather. The hot weather could be. Yeah, or people die responsibly, just throw yes. the fire, right? Mm -hmm, nice. True. All right, let's see who else. Who else must be ready to participate? Elsie, are you ready? Hi. Okay, teacher. Let's okay. go. <laughs> Describe the scene of a hospital. Oh. Mm -hmm. Many uh, people sick. Mm -hmm. A doctor, nurse, a lot of um uh, people oh uh, an anciano old uh -huh. old uh children sick um different different um, type of people with a health problem mm -hmm. yes ambulances uh <laughs> not not grat <laughs> not fun <laughs> not <laughs> next <laughs> emergencies uh -huh. cows warrior people right okay and a lot of people in white mainly right okay thank you Lucy ready yes ready let's go What would you do in a natural disaster, like a storm, a hurricane, an earthquake? Like a like a head, earthquake, earthquake. Uh -huh, like an earthquake, <laughs> right? Just try, just trying to be safe with my family. Mm -hmm. And sometimes I, 
I um, think about that and I think the, the first step I would take is just to take my car and drive so um, in a long, long, long ride <laughs> in a safe place. All right. In this, in this city, um, because I have the, the beach very um, near, the problem probably in the tsunami. Probably disaster, no, exactly a, a tsunami. Mm. And we we always think in my job, for example, they and they activate the alarm mm -hmm. about the previous mm -hmm. in in um mm. some um probably alarm disaster about tsunami. Mm. But they have a system in the port, mm -hmm. and, and this system is useful for um, activate the alarm preview, minus previews okay. about the at least, <laughs> disaster, at least, yeah. But, but we, we never expect anything like that to happen, yeah. Right? Yes, but I think <laughs> it's a, a probably a scenario. Mm -hmm. Only God, only God knows. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. God knows. <laughs> All right, thanks. Okay. Thanks, thanks. Let's see who else. Catherine, are you ready? Yes, teacher. Okay, here we go. Okay, how often do you do exercise or do you exercise? Teacher, it's very <laughs> difficult for me. <laughs> it was the spinner, not me. <laughs> uh, well, I try to do exercise um, maybe two days in a week uh -huh. and I try to walk uh, a long time or um, I don't know when I clean my house I do exercise or when that I wash counts. my clothes <laughs> <laughs> that counts as exercise yes. <laughs> okay uh -huh. and also when I go to the market I try to go walking and also when when I go with my daughter uh, at the park, I try to walk with with her. And sometimes, sometimes, but sometimes, <laughs> and I do exercise in the house. I run or jump. Jumping rope. And that's it. Too. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Nice. Mayra? No. Wanna practice? Hmm? Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> to have be in a flow. It's a flow, but it's a flow. Significa flow. A flood is una inundación. Have you ever been in a flood? ¿Se alguna vez estado en una inundación? Yes, in my house. Oh, okay. Eh, in I, I, I was one in the, in the, one at law, mm -hmm. and, and, como decir, se rompió un daño, no. De la tubería. Uh -huh. So the water pipe was broken. In the water pipe were broken mm -hmm. and I had 
<clears throat> I have a little, 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 little space for, 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 for my family. Oh my God, really? When did that happen? When did that happen? In, in from Last year, 2015. 2015. Really? And that was at night. When? At night. In the noche. Mm, sí, en la noche, en la noche. Really? Okay. So the, the house was floating. Sí, sí, toda la casa. Oh, God. Old house. But you fix it. ¿Sí se pudo arreglar? Yes, one, one year. Old one year. Really? Sí, por lo seguro y todas las cosas. My goodness. <laughs> Difficult. Yes. Okay. Thank you for sharing. Irma, are you ready? Irma? Good evening, teacher. Hello, are you ready to practice? Um, working, working, working. Still working. <laughs> okay, working. can you? Oh my God, can you answer one question? Um, yes. What? Can you answer one question? Yes? Yes. All right, here we go. Okay, name some healthy foods and some unhealthy foods. I not understand, teacher. Que okay, menciona algunas comidas que son healthy, que son saludables, y algunas foods que no son healthy, que son unhealthy. Oh. Mm -hmm. um, saludables. Healthy food. Healthy food. Um, ver, vegetal, 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 vegetable. Vegetal. Uh -huh. um, no, not saludable, serían unhealthy. Unhealthy. Ay, qué chero, si no. <laughs> <laughs> que algo que sea unhealthy. Unhealthy. Um, Junk food. Como la comida chatar. <laughs> Junk food. Sí, como si... Young food. Young food. Mm -hmm. Young food. Young food. Mm -hmm. Desserts, candies, soda. Oh, candies. Mm -hmm. uh, Those and are so soda. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you. Roberto, are you ready? Okay, teacher. No problem. Yes, teacher. Yes, let's go. What's your country? What is your country famous for? ¿Por qué es famoso El Salvador? What is our country famous for? Famoso no? for. Uh huh. Ah, okay. Uh, El Salvador is famous. For pupusas. Mm -hmm. For the typical food. Uh-huh. Um, uh -huh. It's famous for um, the beach, mm -hmm. surf, mm -hmm. Bitcoin. <laughs> 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 yeah. And the person. <laughs> yes. Uh, uh, the sabor is, is famous. Um, uh, for the mountains, and 
the mm -hmm. people, mm -hmm. it's, it's funny. Um, only. <laughs> good. <laughs> good, good, good. Who participate? Who hasn't participated? Victoria, are you ready? Hello. No, Vitalia is not ready. She's not answering. Volunteer? She a participant in Porta. You can participate again. <laughs> I told you the idea is just to speak. Speak. Okay. All right, Hector. And then Hello. Walter. Yes, Hector and then Walter. Let's go, Hector. <laughs> I know your answer, but still, we're going to listen to you. Are you an optimist <laughs> or a pessimist? <laughs> Uh, depend. Maybe it depends. Maybe optimist, maybe a pessimist. Really. <laughs> depends the situation. Really. Uh, I, I think uh, the most time I am optimist because because I have um, I don't know. Depend. <laughs> it's, it's, it's difficult. Uh, I have uh, a different think better uh, than other people maybe i have a health i have a, a thank god i have a, i have a go, i work i have a, uh, my family mm -hmm. who who uh, support who me support uh -huh, support me in in, in the situation when I I have the low battery, <laughs> <laughs> and, you have your uh, cheerleaders at home. Yep. Yeah, for mm -hmm. the for this time is I optimist. I'm pessimist because the 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 problem uh, sometimes is a lot for my for 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 me, but uh, I think one by one I need to resolve it, um, but. I think most optimist. of the time optimistic. Yep. Okay, if you have to you have to balance like the percentage when you are optimistic it's 70 or 80 and the pessimistic like 10, 20. No, uh 60, 40. 60, 40. 60 optimistic, 40 pessimist. All right. <laughs> so, uh, um, the problem, huh? The problem is very so many problems. No, it's not heavy, no, it's not strong, but uh, I I see only problem in in some time situation, mm. you know. All right. But I think. Okay. Should... At least most of the time you are optimist. All right. Let's go with Walter. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's see what stop it. Why? How has the internet changed our lives? This is a, a demonstration. <laughs> this, this is an example, correct? Uh -huh. <laughs> yes. Um, you know, um, maybe everybody knows that the internet and nowadays is very important. But however, we have to to have to be careful how to to use it because at the um, the internet can change our life in in a good way or in a bad way <clears throat> because there, there are a lot of uh, things that is very uh, that we have to uh, to see that is most important mm -hmm. for example <clears throat> we have to take care with our uh, we, with our children, what they see in the internet, mm -hmm. um, because today the all the internet is uh, a lot of websites in different um, that they provide different kinds of um, um, 
uh, how can I explain Content. it? Content. Contents, yes. Mm -hmm. and, and that is not really uh, okay. It's not really fine for yes. kids, right? It's not and, appropriate. Yes. In the other hands, for example, there are a lot of people that is only staying in, in the internet, watching videos, watching Facebooks, I don't know, watching TikTok, that is uh, the most um, popularity in, in, in this in day. In time consuming. <laughs> yes, mm -hmm. that, that, that is uh, um, a reality. kind of thing that change our life, our, our way to think. Mm -hmm. for, for example, there are a lot of people that are walking on the street and, and they're- um, With their cell phone. On the cell phone. A lot right. of people driving a car, driving a motorcycle, but all the time with uh, cell phones. Mm -hmm. True. Yeah, sometimes it's even dangerous. Yes. For their physical integrity, right? But however, they, there is a lot of information that is very useful mm -hmm. that we can use like a tools for our mm -hmm. uh, learning. Yes, mm -hmm. learning. Nice, thank you. Okay. Someone else? Another volunteer? No more. Oh my God, <laughs> no more volunteers. Unbelievable. <laughs> really? Okay. Big thing. <laughs> I have to choose a victim. Thank you, Isabel. <laughs> Would you marry someone from another culture? I think no, so. <laughs> no, I don't think so. <laughs> yes or no? It's possible. Why not? <laughs> yeah. Why not? The, 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 if it's different, um, como sería? race, uh -huh. race is better because the, the genetic is very, very strong. To improve. No, uh, uh, the problem is, is the, uh, the thing about, about the life, maybe God, maybe uh, the, 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 the values, for, for it. Mm -hmm. but I think it's possible for me. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe my my wife not hear me because I. <laughs> <laughs> you are in trouble now after participating in class. It's possible, but <laughs> no, no, no. I'm kidding. I'm kidding, wife. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's, it's only theory. <laughs> it's just a speaking activity. <laughs> All right. Uh huh. Anybody? Do you like to watch a scary movies? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Tell me why. Uh, there are emotions. <laughs> uh, ¿Cómo se dice? Se ponen las pelas de punta. <laughs> you get afraid, scared. You get afraid, afraid. Still. Really? Yeah, yeah. But you it's know it is a movie. What? But you already know that it's just a movie. Um... But you believe the action in the movie. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, I like the action, but mm -hmm. I like it is scary. You I prefer like scary it. movies? Yeah. Uh, I no, no, I prefer the action. Action movies. 
Like All right. Movie. This must move it. All right. Teacher, teacher, yes. too yes. scary, too scary uh, movie. <laughs> you like a scary movies too? You like scary yeah. movies? Yes. Because of Halloween. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Someone else. When was the last time you went on vacations and where did you go? Mm -hmm. Anyone? Um, well, um, the last time was uh, many, um, one month ago. Mm -hmm that we went to that with my family. I like to visit the mountains and mm -hmm. um, specific areas here in San Miguel or in, in another uh, city, for example, in um, San Francisco, there are mm -hmm. a lot of places that is in, with a mountain. The mm -hmm. weather is very uh, comfortable. Mm -hmm. uh, I like to walk on the uh, for example, in the in the forest, mm -hmm. um, camping. Mm -hmm. uh, I went to the um, uh, Llano del Muerto, Perkin. Really, and that's the name of the place. Yes, yes, this is uh, the name of the place. Uh, there is a river, there, are, there, is a, there are a different places that weather is very, cool. very nice. I recommend you. All right, nice. Perkin is a, a nice place. An interesting, place. yeah, it sounds like an interesting town. Yes. Mm -hmm. Let's see, one last question. <laughs> We've been told all in hail storms, like terrible storms. Yeah, probably. Let's see one, another one. Uh -huh. Because of Halloween, probably. Do you believe in ghosts? Anyone? Anyone who believes in ghosts? What? Or anybody, anybody can participate. I'll, I'll not, I live in ghosts, teacher. All right. In. Do you believe in ghosts? I know. I don't. I don't. You don't believe in ghosts? Yes, teacher. If only an invention from people, crazy people. <laughs> Okay, anybody believes in ghosts? Anybody has a different opinion? Are, are not invention. <laughs> <laughs> they are not invention. They are spirits. Yes. Of the devil. Yes, eh, la, la carreta chillona. <laughs> That's a legend. <laughs> no, no. It is a legend. It's, it's, it's true. It's real. It's real. It's real. It's, yes. For, en la llorona. <laughs> uh -huh. and the other pasó. Really? Yeah. Where? La ciguanaba y el cipitillo dice. Eh, with, with my Entonces brother. Eh, no. Eh, pero sí. Exist. Este, increíblemente. No lo quisiera volver a. Really? A escuchar, at night. A escuchar porque porque no la vi, pero sí la escuché. It was at night. Yes. Eh, 11 and 30 minutes. 11.30. Casi las 12. Casi las 12. Almost midnight. Dice que andaba haciendo la calle. And it was Andamos. dark. Andábamos de fiesta. Mm, coming back from the party. Yes. Y era un lugar rural. En, en un lugar solo, solo. Mm -hmm. Y, lo, sí, sí. y los, los sonidos son así como espeluznantes. Sí. 
toma del infierno. Realmente sí. Y rápido se le ponen los sus pelitos de punta. ¿Y qué hicieron ustedes? Correr. Run. No, no pudimos correr. <risa> es, es slow. Es, es lo más terrible. ¿Y qué sentían que se les congelaban las piernas o okay? qué? Ay, nosotros queríamos salir corriendo, pero no nos podíamos mover. Really? ¿Y ahí se quedaron? Yes. yes. ¿Hasta qué pasó o qué? Lo, sí, lo, es lo único que, que estábamos este, cerca de donde había una, una lámpara en un poste eléctrico. Uh -huh. Entonces estábamos en la luz uh -huh. y el ruido venía de, de una parte donde no daba la luz oscura. Uh -huh. Y nosotros dijimos, aquí uno va a pasar enfrente. Uh -huh. Y mi modo, o sea, el, el miedo lo... ¿Lo petrificó? Lo petrificó, pero no pasó ahí. O sea, por eso que no la vimos nunca. La escuchamos y, ¿Y luego... Se el, al, ¿Y se alejó el ruido o qué? Al momentito el ruido ya iba al otro lado, como si yo hubiera pasado frente a nosotros y ya iba al otro lado. Y se fue. Ah. <risa> Díganos, yeah. la, díganos el lugar, ¿cómo se llama? ¿Dónde sucede eso? Ah, es allá donde, de donde soy originario. Bueno. Cantón, Cantón La Chila, en La Libertad. ¿Really? ¿La Chila? Yes. ¿Y de qué pueblo? De Comasagua. De Comasagua. Sí. Es que un día fui a no, no, un compañero. Él es de... por La Perla. Ah, es más por... Después de los túneles. Ajá, del uh -huh. Mahawala hacia adelante. Uh -huh. Super far, far away. Yes, very far, far away. Yes, but it's beautiful. His cousin ahora tiene un, un restaurante que se llama Super Olas. Cuando puedan, vayan. Está super ah, cool. Ah, uh -huh. Super Olas. Uh -huh. Creo que ya. No sé cuál es el último que... túnel. Aquí sí, haciendo que... publicity. Creo que ya le, ya le he despachado algunos pedidos. Really? And the yes. view, and the view is super nice. It's super pretty. Yes, so we, sí. we went on a tour. Okay, thank you for participating. Ya ven. The ghost exists. According to Isabel. Yo tengo, yes. nunca he visto ni escuchado nada. But my brother says, yes. My brother believes in ghosts. Él dice que sí vio. Because he used to go to work, like far, far away también en un área rural. Y regresaba justamente, a, pero él a la pleno 12 del mediodía. Él se venía, pero súper rápido y tomaba un atajo. No se iba por la calle, sino que se iba por un atajo para llegar más rápido, cambiarse y irse a la escuela. So he said he saw the Siwanaba, sitting on a rock. He said that he nunca le dio la cara, solo así, like, covering her, her face with her hair. Pero yo le dije, ¿estás seguro que no era una mujer normal? She was not a normal woman, he said. And he tried to escape. And he was only like 16 years old. But this is just because, you know, Halloween. <laughs> it's okay not to believe. It's okay. <laughs> If you don't believe, it's fine. No problem. <laughs> okay. So as I was saying, huh, talking about manuals. Escriban en el, en el chat si todos tienen un manual de su empresa. Ya sea manual de convivencia, manual de actividades, manual de procedimientos, anything. Escriban en el chat. We have a manual of procedures. Or we have a manual for the customer service. Or we have a manual for whatever. Okay, para lo que tengan un manual. Okay, a lot of manuals. <laughs> for example, Sam. Uh, for example, from, for example, a uh, security manual. Mm -hmm. This is the most ex uh, a big one, exp extensive, mm -hmm. um, uniform manual. Um, for the dress code. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Um, for the guards, it's very specific. Uh, the, the point of the uniform, mm -hmm. the face, the hair, the smell, the the personal cleaning. Uh, uh mm -hmm. an earthquake and oh, a disaster manual okay. too uh -huh. and everything have so a manual there are yeah. so many manuals at your yeah, company yeah yeah and you know all But, of them excuse me yeah uh, <laughs> a lot of yeah a lot of them all yeah right. because uh, because they have a manual for each division Mm. Not, not everybody knows the other division. Right, I got you. 
All right, yes, here it is, yes, okay. A lot of manuals, okay, welcome handbook, all right. So to be welcoming, have manuals of procedures in the job, okay. We have a manual for good practices of different things, process manuals, all right, great. So this is basically, yeah, I, I guess at my work there are a lot of manuals. But the one that we give like must update it, it's the one that uh, has the rules of the right behavior and the foundation for the participant. So we have manuals for um, safe, in a respectful environment among the, the, the participants, I mean, the scholarship holders. But of course, that depends on the type of job. I mean, yes, we have manual, my work, about the rules into the place, different procedures, and what we have to follow. All right, great. Okay, well, the manual that you have for <laughs> Insta4 as well. So it says, make suggestions about the relevance of topics in a procedure manual. Is there a manual with procedures in your workplace? Do you think this manual can be improved? Okay, so these are the two questions that we're going to discuss with our partner. Okay, if there is a manual for procedures, okay, so when you are not pretty sure of what to do, you go and check the manual. Okay, so the manual for the procedures, the manual for the uh, the steps to follow. Okay. Oh, yeah, now that I remember, we do have a manual for all the subjects uh, with all the objectives and the and the different procedures that we must follow in order to accomplish the goals, to fulfill the, the, the objectives. Definitely, right? So, and then if you think this manual can be improved, Improve is, se puede ser mejorado. What do you think you need to do to improve this manual, okay? So these are the two questions that you have to discuss with your partner. And then we read the conversation about the staff meeting. You can read it among you. And then of course, we're gonna practice it in the general meeting, all right? Let's see, let's make the groups for you to discuss the questions and for practicing the conversation as well. All right. A little bit tired. Uh, mm. Mm, a little sleepy. A little bit. Uh, but uh, I don't sick. Ah, no. uh, uh, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the, the tarea, the task, is tarea. Yeah? Yes, task. Uh, that is this uh, talk about the manual. Hi, teacher. Could you have a little that? Oh, yes. Thank you. I'm sorry. I have forgotten. <laughs> okay. No problem. We need to create the main step to include in the manual of training of our staff. What do you propose? What do you propose? 
<ríe> no sé cómo se pronuncia esa palabra. Pro, 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 propose, creo que es. Propose. Propose, algo así. Propose o propose. <ríe> algo así. Okay. Vaya, el compañero ahí. Ok. First, servers need to know the correct way to present the menu. Wouldn't it be better if chap cha chapter, sorry, sorry, if chapter one is about how servers should greet the customers in after the how they need to present the menu, menu, so. Actually, it would be better if we include the servers, dress code and appearance in the first chapter, chap chapters, chapters. Uh -huh. Chapter. Eh, ahora hagamos switch. Ahí está. Ok, ya la. Ahí está, ya. Ok, thank you. Ya la decimos. La conversación. Eh, eh, repeat. You repeat the conversation. You, rep eh, you conversation repeat. Eh, eh, ¿Verdad? Yes. Okay. Uh, and you? Uh, we, we need to read the mind state to include it in the manual to train it or start. What do you propose, customers? After that, how they need to present the menu. Actually, it will be will be better in me if we include the servers dress code and appearance in the first chap chapter. But ahora sería Vitelia, Sara, y va a ser René para aquí. Okay. Y yo sería Walter y Sonia sería. No, ¿qué es que ha sido? Fatima, ya fuiste Sonia. Ya fuiste Sonia. Yo sí. Eh, Sara, ¿quién, ¿quién no ha sido Sara? Yo. Yo ya fui Sara también. Y yo ya fui Sara. Me tocaría Sara. Y a mí Entonces, igual. We need. Y Fátima, ¿quién le tocaría? Walter. Walter. Ajá. Uh -huh. Bueno, démosle. We need to create the main stick to include in the manual to train our staff, what do you propose? First, a quien le toca? A ti. First, servers need to know the correct way to present the menu. Will not be, will not it be better? Is sharp charter. One is about how servers should, should rate the customer and after that, how they need to present the menu. Actually, it will be better if we include the service dress, color, and appearance in the first shop, chapter. Es actually. Hola. Actually. 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 Ok. Mm -hmm. Gracias. Ahora. Chapter. We include a server's dress code and appearance in the first chapter. Ok. Ahora yo, Walter. Okay. We need to create the main step to include in the manual to train our staff. What do you propose? First service need to know the correct way to present the menu. Wouldn't it be I better know. if... 
wouldn't it be better if chapter one is about how servers should greet the customers and after that, how they need to present the menu? Actually, it will be better. If we include the service dress code and appearance in the first chapter. Ahorita. Chapter. chapter. Mm -hmm. What more we have to do, teacher, uh, after read the dialogue? Just to discuss if you have a manual, if you do have manuals at work, and if they can be improved, and how can they be improved? What other things do you need? I mean, do you think that the manuals need? Our manuals. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Okay, Irma, uh, do you have any kind of manuals in your business or in your work? Mm -hmm. uh, 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 for example, uh, in my case, uh, I don't touch a circuit breaker uh, while being a circuit breaker, stay in line, uh, distribution electricity. O sea, mientras mm -hmm. esté en línea no se puede tocar. Eh, mm -hmm. So, I have five rules. Eh, five. Five. Five rules. Five rules. Really? Uh -huh. Es eh, open the circuit breaker, number one. Number two, eh, open the dispositive eh, for cut the, the supplies energy. Uh, number three, uh, we must uh, test testering ausence voltage. So, tenemos que medir la ausencia de voltaje con un equipo especial. Uh, number three, number four, uh, we we must uh, put, le llamamos tierras locales, son cables con uh -huh. quijadas en los extremos. Uh -huh. eh, una quijada va a la malla de tierra y la otra va a los cables del interruptor que ya está aislado. Uh -huh. Y number five, eh, the limit area, uh -huh. un red con un yellow band. Mm. Hey, do, do you wear 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 uh, a special clothes for for making yes. the job? Yes, I. Rubber. <laughs> I use clothes. <laughs> no. use clothes uniform. Uh -huh. yes, uh, la, the, la tela, no sé, I don't know. Uh, how do you say tela? Uh, es para que no agarre fuego tan rápido. Híjole. Porque ya han habido accidentes serios en otras áreas. I, I saw, uh, uh, I don't know, five years ago, saw uh, uh, a man who have a shock electric, but he, he died. The servers dress called an appearance in that first chapter. ¿Lo practicamos de nuevo? Yes. Ok. It's your turn. Here we go. <clears throat> we need to create the main step to include in the manual to train our staff. What do you propose? First, server need to know the correct way to present the menu. Wouldn't it be better if chapter one is about how servers show grade the customer and after that how they need to present the menu? Actually, it would be better if we include the server dress code and appearance in the first chapter. 
Okay. Very good. Finished, teacher. All right, no problems. Mm, no, teacher. All right, thanks. En ese caso sería el manual del, del trabajo, ¿verdad? Ah. Aquí ya se corta. Hola. Me, se, me escuchan porque voy pasando en un lado que no da mucho la señal. Sí se le escucha, es el manual. Hola. Would it be better if chapter one is about how servers should wait the customer and after that how they need to present the menu? Actually, it would the better if we include the server. We need to create. Done. All right. So, any volunteer tell me if there is a manual with procedures in your workplace and if you think this manual can be improved. Any change that can be made. Mm -hmm. Anyone? Any volunteer? Uh -huh. Okay, Catherine, go Just ahead. start with the conversation. No. Well, let's start. It says, is there a manual with the procedures in your workplace? Oh. And if you think this manual can be improved. Mm, I was telling my my um, my partners, the girls, when I when I um talk in the breakout room mm -hmm. there in my job in is a procedure for any task mm -hmm. is a easy activity and we need to previous that that task mm -hmm. to review the the manual for mm -hmm. how how make the that job mm -hmm. and that is a like a requirement to start um, the the job and they uh, give you like construction or a training and then to that we need to sign a, a document it's like a obligation yeah. that you already know what to do yes all right so do you think there are some improvements needed do you think yes uh-huh for example yes. 
for example, I think that is strong show previously instructions. And I, I think there are more there. We need to detail more information about the job for mm -hmm. a technical technical points mm -hmm. uh, I think are very general mm -hmm. but, so, okay so the improvement is that there should be more details more details yes all right because, be more specific the, yes because the the people think in the field and sometimes they have a doubts about the topic and I think the that doubts may be should be more clear in the training. In the manual, in the training. In the manual, All yes. right, perfect. Thank you, thank you for sharing. Somebody else? The same, just the intro, where it says, is there a manual with procedures in your workplace? And do you think these manuals can be improved? Anyone else? Or the manuals at your work are perfect, fine. No improvements needed. They are okay. Teacher. Yes. In my case, my in my, my company, mm -hmm. the manual is very, very simple, I think. Mm -hmm. Talk about the um shopping compras. Mm -hmm. Yeah, purchases uh, or shopping. Uh, this, this thing. Mm -hmm. But uh, uh, I talk with with my uh, with Carlos. Mm -hmm. and one of, uh, for Carlos is very important because the if 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 the people uh, come on, see follow follow the instruction. Yes, they don't follow the nothing. instruction. Uh -huh, it's only uh, care the 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 life if don't don't uh, follow the instruction the people may be uh turn like a uh, toast maybe maybe die i mean it's because of security it's, it's because of their life it's, uh, right mm -hmm. yep uh, the manual <laughs> is is special Specific for different different uh, work mm -hmm. for 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 make better the the, the work and, and take care take a uh, care of their own life of their own physical integrity right. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. and this is my my participation. All right, perfect. Someone else. Mm -hmm. No more. Okay. Um, in my work, yes, we have a, a manual mm -hmm. with the procedures. Mm -hmm. uh, but actually, a couple of days ago, uh, we received a new manual mm -hmm. uh, with uh, mm -hmm. different procedures that we have to follow up. Mm -hmm. And maybe it is improved right now. Mm -hmm. Um, I think that the procedures are very important to follow up because there is there is a um, a guide that we have for how to do our our work in the um, in a good way in the best in a good way, way yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But you your work it's probably not very dangerous, <laughs> uh, um, is it? No, sometimes we have to. Uh, we have to go to visit the frame, uh, for example, a project uh, mm -hmm. because uh, we have to uh, take um, a samples about mm -hmm. uh, acoustic, mm -hmm. um, about the uh, acoustic of different places. For example, if we if they need to to install the, the uh, uh, different kind of sounds, we have mm -hmm. to know what equipment. Mm -hmm. Recom um, it's recommended. Recommended, yes. Mm -hmm. But oh. it's dangerous when we have to do in installation, for example. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. But we have, we have 
uh, manual equipment. for safety and equipment yes, and the right equipment. equipment All right, nice, interesting. Oh wow, well. you see, we all learn different things about different jobs that you do. Okay, you practice a conversation, but now we're gonna have a couple of students read first. Walter is here, so he will be the first one because <laughs> he participates in the conversation and I'm going to be Sarah, all right? Okay. You ready? <laughs> okay, we need to create the main steps to include in the manual to train our staff. What do you propose? Uh, first, servers need to know that the correct way to present the menu. Wouldn't it be better if Chapter one is about how servers should greet the customers and after that, how they need to present the menu. Actually, That's all, yeah, you are, yeah, Rene, now Walter still. <laughs> uh -huh. Actually, it would be better if we include the server's dress code and appearance in the first chapter. Okay, everybody has like a different opinion and a different suggestion, right? And they propose something different. Okay, nice. <clears throat> Thank you for helping. All right, let's see. I'm gonna read it again in case you have any question, please let me know. We need to create the main steps to include it, to include in the manual to train our staff. What do you propose? First, servers need to know the correct way to present the menu. Wouldn't it, wouldn't it be better if chapter one is about how servers should greet the customer and after that, how they need to present the menu? Actually, it would be better if we include the server stress code and appearance in the first chapter. Okay, what is the idea? <clears throat> Why everybody's giving their opinion? Mm -hmm. What do they need to create? Uh -huh. Thinking. <laughs> Sarah says we need to create Uh, maybe because, um, for example, in a big company, exists different kind of area mm -hmm. and different um, manager for that mm -hmm. area. Mm -hmm. And that manager think different about the, uh, the procedure that they, they have to follow. Right. And they take a consideration what they need. Exactly. So they say, we need to create the main steps to include in the manual to train our staff. So they need first a manual. And that manual is, what's the purpose of the manual? Uh -huh. What do they need to create a manual? Give instructions. Okay, to give instructions. Uh huh. It here says to train the staff. Exactly, to train the staff, to give a training, to give instructions on how to do the things at work, right? And then they ask, What do you propose? So everybody gives idea of what to include in this manual. To train the staff. To train them is to give the information, to guide them, okay, on how to do their work. So what there's a servers, obviously, the staff in this case, remember is the staff of a restaurant. That's why they talk about this. So they say servers in this case is no, the servers of the computer, right? In this case, is the people that serve the customers, right? Servers need to know the correct way to present. Mm -hmm. 
menu. The menu, exactly. The menu. So they need to know, they need to follow, they need to do it the same way. No, if, if they want to do it one way this day, if they want to do it another day, another way another day, or if they don't want to do it the same way other waiters do it. No, everybody has to be trained, right, on how to present the menu, the correct way to present the menu. And then Sonia says, wouldn't it be better if chapter one is about how server should greet the customer and after how they need to present the menu. So the first thing she consider it is necessary to include in the chapter one is how to greet the customer. And then after that says how they need to present the menu. So she still considers that presenting the menu is a really, really good point to take into consideration in the steps for the manual. And then Rene says, actually, it would be better if we include the server's dress code and appearance in the first chapter. It's, he considers that the first thing that they must consider to include is the dress code and the appearance in the first chapter. So he considers that the presentation, like the personal presentation is more important than the way they greet the customer and then the way they present the menu, right? So this is the conversation about, okay? Just give me one second, please. All right, <clears throat> let's see. Did you all practice this conversation and did you find any difficult word, any difficult expression or something that you want to paraphrase in the conversation? Is everything clear? Mm -hmm. Anybody? Clear as the water? Yes, teacher. Clear oh. as the water. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. Teacher, the second attendance. True, 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 true. Hold on. Oh my God, I forgot. Let's see. Adriana, not here. Carlos. Present, teacher. Okay. Cristina. Present. Elsie. Present, teacher. Fatima. Present, teacher. Arrive. <laughs> okay, yes. nice. Let's see, Hector. Present, teacher. Isabel. Present. Catherine. Present, Lucy. teacher. Mayra. Present, Lucy. Present, teacher. Thank you, thank you. Nuri. Nahir. Roberto. Samuel. Present. Vitelia. Present. Walter. Present, teacher. Wendy. I am yes. here, teacher. And Irma. Yes. Present, teacher. Thank you. By the way, okay. Bye. Todo estaba claro con la conversación, seguros. Sure. Bye. Sure. ¿Cómo es? Yes. Uh, what is the mean? Uh -huh. uh, dress code. El dress code es como el código de vestimenta. Por ejemplo, en su caso, si oh, es okay. ajá, un uniform, o sea, no puede ir a hacer su trabajo sin ese uniform. Porque para uh -huh. empezar, está poniendo riesgo su vida, su safety. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Y así son las empresas. Obviamente, uh, en nuestro caso, que somos docentes, eh, no podemos usar así como que cualquier cosa que queramos, ¿verdad? just because. Realmente tenemos como una camisa con, con 
el incentivo de la institución, de la fundación, bla, bla, bla. Y no porque, pues, los, los chicos, sobre todo en el, en el sistema de, de cuando se da clases a niños o, o personas, digamos, que no tienen la madurez como para decir, ay, que el teacher es mi chero, que no se quede. Generalmente tiene como a confundirse ese tipo de cosas. Obvio, es que no es por safety, pero es por u otras razones. Pero sí se tiende a, a, a seguir un dress code. Thanks. All right. Anybody else? No more? Are you sure? Pregunten ahora. O callen para no ver. O be silence forever. <laughs> Bye. Ya hemos visto esta parte. Esta parte de wouldn't, wouldn't it be better? ¿Le suena o oh, le suena raro? ¿A qué le suena? Pregunto porque después me deciden más que no entendí. Este, wouldn't. Wouldn't it be better? ¿Cómo lo interpretan? Podría. Uh -huh. No podría ser mejor decir. No podría ser mejor. Uh -huh. Wouldn't it be better? Pero traten como de, o sea, que suene casi que una sola frase, ¿verdad? Acuérdense que en inglés esto de los linking sound es como súper común. Entonces, wouldn't, wouldn't it, wouldn't it be better? O sea, casi que suena como un trabalengua, como un tongue twister. Wouldn't it be nice? En la, en la canción creo que es el soundtrack de 51st States, que se dice, wouldn't it, wouldn't it be better? Y el otro es, would it be, it would be, would it be, It would be, it would be better, better, very, very bad para mi sweat. Vaya, eso es como para challenge, para la pronunciación. Vaya, pero yo sé que la practicaron varias veces. Pero igual vamos a escuchar a una sola persona decir los cuatro personajes, Sara, Walter, Sonia, René. Y la primera víctima de esta practice será Lucy. Hello, teacher. Hi. Okay, Sara, we need to create the main steps to include the manual to train our staff. What do you propose? Walter, first, servers need to know the correct way to present the menu. Sonia, wouldn't be, be wouldn't be, be wouldn't, <laughs> wouldn't it be better? <laughs> If chapter one is about how servers should greet the customers and after that, how they need to present the menu. Rene, actually, uh, it, it will be better if we include the server's dress code and appearance in the first chapter. Yes, of course, if we include. Okay. If we include, okay. Yes, it would be better if we include. All right. Next, it's going to be un caballero, Carlos, Roberto Carlos, por tener una imagen pasando. Wouldn't it, wouldn't it be better if we choose somebody else because Roberto Carlos is not answering. <laughs> All right, let's see. Sam. Sorry about my dog. It's crazy about the fireworks. Oh, really? Yeah. But, okay. It's all right. Okay, it's all right. We need to create the main steps to include the main ones to train our staff. What do you propose? First, servers need to know the correct way to present the menu. Wouldn't it be better if chapter one is about servers should greet the customer and after that, how they need to present the menu? Actually, it will be better if we include the server's dress code and experience in the first chapter. Thanks. All right. No problems? Anyone? You sure? All right. <laughs> Read the contents in a server's training manual. 
organize the top base to create the index of the manual on the right, then present your index to the class and explain the reasons for your choice. In summary, en síntesis, ¿qué van a hacer? Vean, acá tienen como, digamos, los, los temas, ¿verdad? Desarrollar. Este es el manual, o estos son los temas que se han propuesto para el manual, para el training de, de, de los servers. Setting a table, decanting wine, requesting a chief change, following the schedule, addressing kitchen personnel, getting to know the menu, dress code, addressing customers, about tips and taxes, prevention of accidents and safety. Ajá. Vaya, échale un ojo a todo ese vocabulario y luego me dicen, what's the meaning of? Primero descarten todas las que sí saben y luego vamos a revisar los que no saben. ¿Hay alguno de esos términos que no les quede claro? De canting, teacher. De canting wine. Esa es la, la acción de servir el vino. De un recipiente a otro, como he escuchado el término catación, como catar. Pero ¿Cuál, es, ¿Cuál término? Catación de vino. Catar, probar. ¿No? Vale, déjeme un poquito, le voy a buscar una, una imagen que represente. <ríe> Creo que igual. Vaya, los experts en wine me, me corrigen, please. ¿Cuál es el objetivo de servir de un recipiente a otro el wine? ¿Alguna idea? Que se oxigene. Uh -huh. Dicen que pierde los sedimentos. Obviamente ustedes saben que para preservar el vino se hacen barricas, ¿verdad? Y esos son obviamente construidas de madera que se tiene por mucho tiempo, que están en algún nivel de oscuridad y todo eso. Entonces es eso. Humedad. De humedad también. Right. Veamos. Canting wine. Por acá está. Se lo pongo. Entonces, igual, la catación de vino es eso, ¿verdad? De servir el vino en copas. De ir este, probando, obviamente, para... ¿Qué es lo que se identifica? El grado de color, ajá. Vaya. El sabor, la acidez, Exacto. el cuerpo. Ahí está. Aquí tenemos experts. Vamos a aprovechar ese knowledge. <risa> <risa> Yo solo he visto en películas. <risa> I've just seen it on movie. Yo creo que sí, realmente es eso. Es, una, es un arte, pues, una ciencia. Entonces... 
esto es un procedimiento que lo tienen que hacer obviamente los trabajadores de un restaurant. Sí, es un restaurante que obviamente sirve wine, ¿verdad? porque no todos los restaurantes lo hacen, obviamente tienen que tener algún grado de, no sé, ¿cómo se clasifican? No se clasifican por stars como los hotels, los restaurantes. Hay como un rating. Sí. Ajá, porque los restaurantes no todos son así como que, así, picky, ¿verdad? O, super high, entonces obviamente no en un fast food restaurant no van a hacer de wine, pero ya en un restaurante fino, no sé si sirve wine, entonces, ese proceso es el de canting wine, ya, el hecho de servirlo previamente, o no sé si a todos los wines, ustedes me corrigen igual, este, no les ponen hielo, pero sí los ponen a enfriar, algunos, o, prefieren que no, Ahí también es cuestión de, de los gustos. Cuestión de gustos. Uh -huh. pero, pero sí, he visto que algunos wines, no sé si de, tiene que ver con el color o qué, que los ponen, pero obviamente en el hielo, no es que les echen el hielo al wine. Los rosados sobre todo. Uh -huh. no, los sparklings, ¿verdad? Y eso también tiene que ver con el tipo de food, que no va a, com Ajá, no va a tomar red wine, y va a comer alguna carne blanca, por ejemplo. Bueno, depende, pero... pero no, pero normalmente sí, normalmente sí. Es, es, uh -huh. el, el vino rojo es con, con carne claro. roja. Ajá, generalmente van como los mismos tonos, pero... Sí. Uh -huh. El blanco es con las con la blancas, pescados uh -huh. y, y pollo. Ajá, exacto. Eso es... Ya saben, es otro rollo, obviamente. Entonces, pero sí, a eso se refiere el término de canting muy el hecho de servirlo en otro recetario. ¿Sabe, ¿Sabe cuál pudiera ser una, una, uh -huh. una muy buena comparación? Uh -huh. y, y, y la misma palabra lo da, el, el, el de cantar. Uh -huh. de, 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 es el hecho de, de, de canto, vea, de, de darle vuelta, de, uh -huh. de cantar. Uh -huh. Pues sí, puede ser. Sure. ¿Algún otro término? ¿Queda claro este? ¿Y estamos bien? Requesting a chief change. Es cuando, por ejemplo, un server, o sea, un, un trabajador de un restaurant tiene un shift, por decir algo, su horario de trabajo va desde las 6 de la tarde hasta que cierra el restaurant pero tiene alguna dificultad y quiere que le cambien el turno al turno de la mañana, por decir algo, o al turno más temprano. Entonces eso se tiene que submit, generalmente hacer como una petición formal de un permiso o que le, o que le cambien el turno de trabajo. Ese es requesting a change. El hecho de hacer la petición de forma así seria, que le hagan el cambio de su horario de trabajo. Pues no necesariamente tiene que ser permanente, aunque a veces puede ser permanente, o a veces solo por un día o por dos días. Uh -huh. Que le, le permitan ir a trabajar en otro horario que no es el que, al, que le han asignado previamente. ¿Está todo claro? ¿Es everything clear? Setting a table. ¿Qué sabemos qué es? Poniendo la mesa, tal vez. Uh -huh. Poner la mesa, exacto. No necesariamente, digamos, obviamente esto va a depender de las categorías del restaurant, pero en muchos de los restaurantes nada más limpiar, right? Y que esté todo clean, sobre todo en los restaurantes de fast food. Despejar todo, limpiar, sanitizar, bla, bla, bla. Pero en muchos restaurantes es hasta cambiar el mantel, cambiar la, los vasos, los, obviamente todo eso, ¿verdad? Muchas de las cosas. Y tienen que cambiar por completo. Y quitan todo lo que usaron los, los customers anteriores o aunque no los hayan usado, pero igual los quitan. Y lo vuelven a poner. Los limpios. ¿Ok? Eh, requesting a change, following the schedule o seguir el horario. 
addressing kitchen personnel. Addressing es cómo me refiero a las personas o al personal que está en cocina o cómo les hablo, ¿sí? Cómo los abordo. Eso es addressing the kitchen personal. Getting to know the menu. Getting to know the menu puede, ser, puede sonar así como que, sí, pero ahí está el menú. Ah, pero usted debe conocer el menú como, como trabajador, como server. Digamos que fuera el caso. Ok. The dress code, obviamente, tiene que seguir los, los patrones o los, los códigos de vestimenta de, de la empresa. En este caso, del restaurant, right? Mm, sería como bien como que alguien le esté vendiendo como mesero, como server, y usted se dé cuenta de que no está usando el uniforme que tienen los otros servers, los otros waiters o waitress, right? Addressing customers, la forma en cómo debe tratar a los customers, por tips and ta about tips and taxes, como las políticas de cómo se deben manejar las propinas y los impuestos, los taxes, ¿verdad? Que puede ser que tenga, qué sé yo, A o B, taxes. Obviously, en El Salvador, taxes creo que solo es el IVA, right? Pero... In the United States, taxes are so many. Okay, prevention of accidents and safety. Bye. Aquí tienen como el contenido. ¿Qué es el reto que tienen ustedes? Es ponerlo, si ustedes fueran a montar todos esos temas en un manual, en el orden de importancia, ¿en qué orden irían? O sea, ¿qué de todo es lo más importante para que vaya al inicio, en zona, en zona? Bye. Tienen 10 minutos para montarlo con sus partners. O sea, so, ustedes solo escriban la clasificación en el orden en que lo pondrían ya en el manual. Ya solo para darle print. Bye. Con las mismas personas que trabajaron lo pueden decidir en 7 minutos. Dice los clientes. Addressing, addressing customer. ¿Dónde está? Addressing, addressing. customer. Ah. Uh -huh. Me parece. Ah. Addressing. Number eight. Customer. ¿Y el otro no crees que sería como setting a table? O sea, cómo colocar la sí. mesa. Uh, uh -huh. first. Uh -huh. setting, setting a table. Uh -huh. uh, a table. Después. Después. Ah, pero mira, hay uno que dice following the schedule. Ah, seguir el horario. Uh -huh. uh, Creo que no diría después de tres calls. 
Tal vez el uno es... Espérate, el, el que seguimos fue addressing customer. Uh -huh. Tal vez para Address tener una call. lógica puede ser el otro que dice addressing featured personal. O sea, como para verlo como una secuencia. Ah, hi, Mayra. No la había visto. Ah, eh, de veras. Sí, como ¿verdad? ya estoy clavado en esto, no lo había visto. Sí, no, yo igual aquí estoy viendo en la computer. En la computer. Ajá, entonces lo que te quería decir es que como, como tenemos como segundo eh, addressing customers uh -huh. para llevar como una secuencia lógica también. Hello. Yes. Yes. La presión de accidentes. Yes. Um... I think number two. Mm. Código de vestimenta. Tres call. Yes. Teacher, um, esta imagen no nos la envió, ¿verdad? Yes, I send it to WhatsApp. Ah, déjame ver aquí no. Um, no sé ahí eh, qué piensa o, o si cambiamos ese or mm. Walter um, hola eh, sí vaya yo pienso que <coughs> podría ser como addressing customers um, uh -huh. como ella dijo la forma de cómo dirigirse a los clientes. Para mí es algo bien importante. Uh -huh. eh, otra ah. vez. Sí, sorry. Eh, Walter, hablábamos eh, con Fátima de, de lo importante también de setting a table. O sea, cuando el customer llegue. Um, a table. Ajá. La mesa puesta porque la presentación igual que el, el dress call en los... Correcto. Eh, eh, es importante porque es como la primera impresión que usted se lleva, el orden, la limpieza, todo eso. Entonces, Exacto. Igual eh, lo de otra cosa que, que va como en los primeros sería como getting the getting to know the menu. O sea, uh -huh. También es como, son como las primeras cosas que pienso yo, ¿verdad? Esto sí. Entonces, en in the, in the first place, you put in the dress code with the first place or which one? ¿Pondrían mm. ustedes como primer lugar el dress code? I think sería a table, pero... Mm. Yo creo que sería dressing customers. Mm -hmm. dressing como, customers. como dirigirse a los clientes. Yes, addressing customers is very Number, important. Uh, first. Uh, first. Mm -hmm. Tienen que lavar el, en horas después de que termina la, la hora de laborar. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Ah, bueno.
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One escape addressing costs addressing personal addressing teacher what does it mean addressing customer sorry addressing customer is the way you talk to the customers ah uh, okay mm -hmm. okay this in then that way this is uh to be in the second place. Okay, this is as this is the way I I I I will show do. All right. First first is a they know the menu. Mm -hmm. Second, the addressing customer. The third, uh, setting a table for the canteen wine. Next, address code. Mm -hmm. And after that, uh, addressing kitchen personal. After all the first line, uh, all the first line, is, uh, all the first line, experience and follow with with the internal with internal rules for example how to follow when correctly the schedule how to request an chief change even taxes and i will finally with a prevention of accident and safety all right thank, thank good, you good proposal <laughs> All right. Probably different groups have a different proposal of orders, right? So it's only what you suggest, it's only what you propose. What you consider is more important should be the first two and third chapter, right? The first, second, and third chapter from the orders, right? So we're going to present this tomorrow in order of importance, okay? So we're going to have a a discussion to get on an agreement okay for now let me have the last attendance be ready for tomorrow to present okay the order of the index of the manual for now let me just have the last attendance and see who is staying tonight adriana carlos present teacher christina present. elsie present teacher fatima Present teacher. Hector. Present teacher. Isabel. Present. Catherine. Catherine, Catherine. Ya se no fue Catherine. Oh no, aquí está. Catherine, tonight is your 10 minutes, one on one. Hello. All right, teacher. Hello. You are staying tonight for the one on one session. Hey. Yes. Sorry, it's good. I have a bad connection. Really? Yes. All right, Lucy. Hello. Can you stay, Lucy? Thank you. Stay. All right. Great. So we're gonna switch with Catherine. So Catherine might stay tomorrow. Mayra. Listen. Roberto. Present. Samuel. Vitalia. Walter, present, present. Wendy, Irma. I am here, teacher Wendy. All right, Wendy, thank you. Good. Teacher. Yes. Wow. Good I night. resolved the connection. 
All okay. right. So Lucy, hello. You go and you stay tomorrow. No problem. Okay. That's okay. <laughs> All right. Good night. 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 See you tomorrow. Sleep. <laughs> Rest. Relax. All right. Catherine, Catherine, tell me, is there anything I can help you with? Yes, uh, Tell me. No sé qué. Sorry por la conexión. Pero, no, no, no. Eh, no sé por qué se desconecta el wifi de la casa y me conecta a la red y cuando pasa eso, da un gran problema. Uh -huh. Entonces, tenía consulta con lo de la plataforma porque de hecho... Yo no estuve en las primeras dos clases, entonces... No logré ingresar. Ajá, la verdad no sé nada de eso. Yo sé uh -huh. que hablan y todo, pero no doy con qué. Uh -huh. Y no tengo el número del chico que me habló. Uh -huh. eh, me dijo, ya hizo, tiene dos faltas de la creación. Porque <risa> realmente yo metí los papeles hace bastante. Uh -huh. Entonces eso por, se tardó bastante para sí. meterme a las clases. Y de la noche a la mañana fue como que, mire, ya faltó dos veces a clase. Yo, ¿Cuál ah, clase? <ríe> Va, le voy a compartir pantalla para ir guiando. Bueno. Pues, Vaya, le tuvo que haber llegado un correo con todas estas credenciales. El grupo de WhatsApp, cómo unirse al grupo de WhatsApp, cómo ver los videos en YouTube. Y donde dice el URL de la plataforma de aprendizaje. Este link... Si quiere, obviamente después con tiempo busquen en su correo. Ok. Ajá, tiene que tener ese correo con todas esas credenciales. Obviamente nosotros tenemos más porque, pues nosotros le damos seguimiento a muchas cosas que ustedes no, ¿verdad? Pero sí tiene que tener, por ejemplo, el, el link de cómo unirse al, a la sesión de Zoom. Tiene que tener el link a la, al grupo de WhatsApp, el link a al canal de YouTube, tiene que tener el link a la plataforma. Entonces, cuando le da al link de la plataforma, la va a llevar, regálenme, que dejen de mover, la va a llevar acá, a una plataforma como esta. Vamos a ir al curso. Ok, acá es una plataforma así, que usted va a ir haciendo como los ejercicios de cada sesión. Digan, para el caso, ¿verdad? Está la unidad 1, o sea, aquí tiene actividades y tiene que ir resolviendo. De hecho, toda esta unidad ya la hicieron todos. Igual, bueno, ahorita estamos en la unidad 2. Y tiene videos. Obviamente, siempre relacionado a lo que estamos viendo en la clase. Acá también nos aparecen los videos de la clase que hemos resuelto. Uh -huh. Ok. Ve uh -huh. aquí mismo voy a ver el mismo video de la clase. ¿Sí? ¿Tiempo límite para poder realizar cada unidad? O... De acuerdo a lo que uno va viendo en la clase, debería ir resolviendo. Ah, Digamos, por ejemplo, ahorita ya debería ir en la unidad 2. Debería, Ticha. Uh -huh. No, pero otro, usted tranquilo, igual todavía se puede poner al día. Vaya, aquí está la sección 1. Sí, sí, es, es la unidad 1, ¿verdad? Entonces la unidad 1 tiene como 7 u 8 tareas, creo. Aquí está, quiero ver tarea 1.9. Si tiene nueve tareas, que era lo que estuvimos viendo de, de las diferentes Ay. estrategias. Ajá. Exacto. Entonces, vaya, digamos que nos vamos a la, a la unidad 2, que es lo que estamos viendo ahorita, en la sección 2. Aquí debería estar en esa cabal, como por la. Ahorita que cargue. Sí, aquí, sí, obviamente que es homework, ¿verdad? Pero es que se los tienen que hacer a, a, su, a su ritmo cada vez que vayamos viendo la, digamos, la 2.8. Okay. Tower Food, esto fue lo que vimos la semana pasada. 2.11. Veamos. Ajá. Quiero ver. Sí, estaríamos cabal como por la 2.10. Ok, por acá, 2.8. Está buen food sanitizer, si eso ya lo habíamos visto. A ver. Yo prefer... Ajá, acá está, 2.11 cabal. 
it would be it wouldn't it be better to revise the manual before printing wouldn't it be better to revise justamente el tema que acabamos de ver ve solo que igual si no le no le logra encontrar digamos el, el correo donde tiene todos esos links para accesar a la plataforma eh, igual me escribe y yo le voy a le voy a dar el número de, del técnico para que le para que le escriba él directamente el asesor ok teacher uh -huh. y eh, hay algún otra actividad fuera de la plataforma que se deban de hacer generalmente las de la clase y las de la plataforma igual eh, después de la unidad 2 al terminar la unidad 2 también hay un progress test que es el okay. midterm test uh -huh. um, ok uh -huh. Eh, una, fíjense, teacher, que no sé si es así adecuadamente como lo hago, pero yo busco el correo anterior de la sesión anterior uh -huh. y ahí me meto para poder ingresar a la clase, así uh -huh. es. No es directo de Zoom, digamos. Sí, usted puede hacerlo de Zoom, pero tiene que estar logueada con la cuenta de, ajá, con la cuenta de, de, de corporativo. Ajá, uh -huh. ah, que yo le di corporativo, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. ah, sí, porque si no, no la voy a identificar. <risa> Ah, exacto. Uh -huh. Ok, teacher. Sí. Está bien, entonces. Pero sí, ponga en su favorito ese correo donde le enviaron todas las credenciales para que tenga los accesos así como más disponible. Ok, teacher. Thank you. Ok, good night. Good night. Sí, Sorry tomorrow. for the attendance. That's alright, no problem. <laughs> Pero Bye. Le agarro. Bye. Sí, no Bye. problem. Bye. Bye.